Okay. Um, hello. Uh, my name is Ilya Winter. Um, I go by Sylph. Uh, that's my pilot name. Um, so this uh, FPV crate's a little late. Uh, as you can see, uh, I haven't made a video yet this month, and uh, it finally arrived on October 29th. Uh, and I mean, I guess better late than never. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm happy that it's here, uh, but it's like two days away from Halloween. So, you know, gang's all here and, uh, we're ready and we're all super excited to, uh, to do this here unboxing. <laughs> all right, here we go. Let's see what's inside this bad boy. Once again, I did not prepare a blade, so I am opening up with this um, really, really bad, bad tools that I got from the ethics uh, kit. Bad, 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 bad ethics. Bad, bad tools. Bad tools. Hello, David. When are you gonna come by the shop? I have, uh, I have some props that I want to show you uh, before. Uh, before I send them away. Okay, so it opens up this way. FPV crate. Boom. Ooh, I got it. paint nail. All right, here we go. Let's see what's inside. Let me take a quick peek real quick so that there's no... All right, there we go. If there isn't a single... Let me, let me say this before I open this up. If there isn't a single pumpkin or... Uh, bat or mummy or something inside there I'm gonna be pissed because this is here on um, October 29th two days away from Halloween this better just I want to see candy corn just like spill out of here so all right well we're gonna open up here I'll open it up this way just like the way that y'all y'all can see it yeah there we go so we have the thank you crate which I'm just gonna put to the side because it has all of the um, all right, so no, so we got a sticker sheet as always. We got the FPV crater, uh, a little artwork there. So a little reuse of the artwork. Okay, it's okay. I like I like that design. That's pretty cool. If you read this, flip me. Uh huh. FPV crate group. Some more self branding over there to the moon. All right. <clears throat> So that's that. I thought this. I got. I got excited because I thought this was a mummy, <laughs> but it's most certainly not. It's the FPV Crater artwork that uh, that happened on their own. Uh, that they had a shirt for last time. Okay, more bubbly stuff. Oh my God, this looks like there's not a lot of stuff. <laughs> okay, so more bubbly. Let me see if I can maybe get a better angle. I did not prepare today. I spent more time putting up these cutouts. Uh, than, a, than anything else. All right, so some props clearly. Oh, it looks like a harness for something. All right, so here let's uh, let's go one by one, right? Um, so we got a luminaire antenna. Uh. Not too shabby. This is always good. This is always useful. Um, I don't know if I have uh, a D uh, VTX that takes that kind of connector. Um, but I just ordered a few small VTX. Ooh, Ooh it's cold in here. I just ordered um, some small VTXs, so hopefully that is something that I... Maybe I do I have it right here? Yeah, so I got the TBS Unify Pro 32 Nano. This is my own thing, right? And I don't know if this is... See, this looks like... Yeah, it doesn't have this kind of connector. Uh, maybe I have to get an adapter or something. Looks a little bit annoying. <coughs> but as always, uh, you know, throw it on the bench. Let's see what else we got. Got some props, as per usual. Uh, thrown in, thrown in some props there. We got three sets this time. Um, so we got some hurricane design for racing, all yellow props. It looks like the pitch on them. Here, let's see. Looks like the pitch is pretty. Uh, I don't know. I can't tell. The beginning of the, the beginning of the blade right here looks a little bit aggressive. 
But uh, overall, it doesn't look like too high of a pitch. I wonder if it says anything. So it says 51466-3. Okay, all right. So they're all the same. Yep. And that would be confusing if they were different, the same color but different pitches. Um, okay, yeah, so that's cool. Some props, as, as usual. Uh, let's see what else we got. Give me some give me some goodies. Give me something that I can use. Uh, and here we have a camera. All right, Turbo Micro F2 by Cadex. All right, see, now this is something, you know, it's a camera that I don't really, uh, haven't ever used before. Um, so I'm interested in trying, so I'm assuming that that's what this pigtail or this uh, little wire set is for here. That makes sense, because it was kind of just loose in the package. Um, let me see if that's what it is. Um, I'm going to go ahead and assume that it is, but uh, let me just double check here. Yep, so that fits. So that's what it was. Um, Could have probably put it in the bag, <laughs> but um, that's okay. Not, you know, no, no, uh, nothing there. Oh, I see. So, all right, so we have some... So it's a little bit light. Okay, so I'm I I don't see anything Halloweeny. Um, so not particularly exciting. Uh, but I will say this. So okay, so this is the first time that they've get they've given uh, a couple of things that you can actually use together. I'm gonna get this out of the way. So what we have here is. Um, a Rush Tank VTX, okay, let me see if I can, uh, so we have a Rush Tank VTX, we have a Lumineer uh, AX2, uh, AXAI, I don't know, I don't know how to say that, um, antenna, right, and then now we have this Rush Tank uh yeah. got some stickers <clears throat> see i've always wanted to try these this rush tank uh model of vtx i always kind of go tbs um just because a lot of my other gears tbs tbs and i just wanted to you know kind of like work well together or something I don't know <laughs> maybe I'm just a fanboy but it seems to seems to work a little bit better um, but I have heard see I've heard both positive and negative things about this uh, rush tank VTX <clears throat> so let me see if I can yeah so it looks cool I like the fact that it's like covered you know, like it's got like this little plate and stuff on top. I definitely am a big fan of that because um, a lot of times when you crash or whatever, you know, exposed uh, circuit, like expo exposed onboard circuitry and stuff like that, like that, it gets uh, it gets damaged very quickly. So I'm excited to see. So so I believe if if I am not mistaken, right, this VTX. Because I was just saying, I was like, oh, I don't have anything to uh, plug in, plug this antenna into. But, but, they went ahead and they included it right here in the freaking crate. So I'm actually really happy about this. Because I, I, I thought I was going to, oh, I was going to have to go and, and go and buy something or, or whatever. But no, it's all included. See, we got that and then... Guess what else is included? This little bada bing, bada boom situation, right? Except it doesn't really plug in that way. <laughs> so what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to we're gonna have to get this rush tank pigtail. Oh, see, and it has an adapter for a regular one for a regular antenna. There we go. See, so get this rush tank pigtail. Plug that in. Boom. Then we got to figure out how to make it, you know, attach all those wires or whatever. Boom. Camera, VTX, antenna. Bada bing, bada boom. Go fly something. 
See, I like that. This is cool. This is kind of, it all works together. And along, so with, with the two previous crates, so the previous crate, we got the main uh, main bad boy in the crate was, um, what? It was a ESC, right? It was a 40, 45 amp ESC. And the one before was a Mamba flight controller. So if you're following along, because that's when I started. I didn't start from the first crate, but I started from the second. So if you've been following along, Minus that one with the shirt, or no, with the with the hat in the beginning. What was I mad about? I don't even remember. But if you've been following along, technically you have a whole quad between, you know, between this crate and then the two previous crates. Like, that's a fully functioning quad, Mi minus the motors, obviously. That's on, you know, I don't imagine that they're going to send motors. Maybe they will. I have no idea. Um, but this is cool. I like this. I, I can, you know, I can work with this. This is awesome. You have a camera, you got a spare VTX, um, spare antenna, which just fits slots right in there. I'm happy. I mean, the only, the only thing that could have made this crate better is like, like if I had opened it up and a single solitary candy corn spilled out of it and onto my desk and I could put it in my mouth Oh man, that would make, make me so happy. But unfortunately, that's not the case. And even though um, it, it, it arrived on the 29th, <laughs> two days before Halloween, um, there isn't a single Halloween-y type thing in here. But that's okay, because it's not all about, uh, it's not all about, like, you know, gimmicks and stuff like that. Sometimes it's just about the hardware. And in this case, uh, you know, FPV crate pulled through. I think it's cool. Let's look at the, um, so yeah, definitely thumbs up for me on this one. Um, all usable stuff. Um, let's see, right? So it says, ah, here we go. <clears throat> so it says rush tank, 5.8 gigahertz VTX with smart audio. Cadex turbo micro F2 FPV camera. Lumineer uh, X2, X II straight MMCX. 5.8 gigahertz antenna, Jam Fan Hurricane uh, propellers, three sets, FPV Crate October sticker sheet, two dollars, and then a discount coupon card, which is not included. So, overall, I mean, this is this is good. I like this. Here, let's get some sponsors on there. Yeah, Jam Fan, Lumineer, Cadex, Rush. Very very nice. All right, so. Uh, Thanks for watching. Um, this has been my monthly update of what the hell is in the FPV crate. Um, everybody say bye to uh, this random zombie. We have uh, 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 Aquaman. I don't know why they took me that long to remember who Aquaman was. Um, we have Hitler the horse here. Uh, don't ask me why his name is Hitler. I did not name him. Uh, <laughs> anyway, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, and uh, yeah, that's the end of the video. Uh, I approve. Let's keep them, keep the good hardware coming. Peace.